Hello, and welcome back to my playthrough of Persona 3 Reload. Last time, we finished the Fortune Social Link. Now let's get back to Aegis. So, I've been continuing my search for an Michan san but I haven't had any luck yet. Anyways, Ming-san, I would like to walk home with you again. Is that okay? Yes. Thank you very much. Today is another cold day. Let's hurry before it gets dark. than you used to be. This little one is all I have left to keep me company. I was so lonely when Michan was missing. I don't know how I can thank the both of you. Lonely is being by oneself lonely. Oh, yes, dear. When you get to be my age, You'll find that all the wealth in the world won't take care of you. No one can truly live alone. Some of my neighbors have delightful children, but... Oh, oh, they aren't interested in old ladies like me. Miss. Well, Michan, shall we go home? <laughs> Thank you so much, you two. It seems that living is something that can't be done alone. You might be right. Yes, it's important to keep someone in your thoughts, and to know that you are in theirs. To be able to contact them anytime, and to touch them. <sighs> But I do understand one thing. It seems I feel happy when I'm together with you. I guess it's smiling shyly. It seems we've grown closer. Halfway there. But I have to wonder if living means to be able to connect with other people. How close to that goal can I come with a body like mine? Hmm. Just kidding. I've been exceedingly negative lately. I wonder what's wrong with me. We should start heading back. I guess she's becoming more human by the day. Welcome back. What's up, dude? After today, it'll be just 10 more days till the day Ryoji was talking about, huh? Alright, I'm hyped. We're gonna blow that next thing away. And hopefully Elizabeth as well. What have we got here? Sure, I'll help. I owe you one. Eden eggs are essential for building a healthy body. And there's no better choice than chicken. I cook food and athlete would eat with Sanana. This should last a while. Let's put it in the freezer. Super athlete meal. Thanks for always helping out. Let me know when you want some more. this so suddenly but can you come with me there's something we need to discuss uh you want all of us or just him just him for now come with me to the student council room Weird that she'd only want to talk to him? Eh, probably big, important student council business. Maybe, but 
Senpai was acting a little weird. She had that look she gets when she's keeping some terrible secret. Ah, you worry too much. Well, guess we might as well head home. Hey, wait a sec, Junpei. According to the seating chart, if he's not here, you have to take over cleaning duty. Have fun sweeping the hallway. What? Since when? There's something you have to know. Do you remember Chidori, the girl who was with Strega? I don't mean to alarm you, but the truth is, there's a chance that she may wake up today. What? She's alive? I know what you're going to say, and yes, we did see her die with our own eyes. However, a few days later, her body began to undergo transmogrification. For the past few weeks, she's been in a sort of stasis, neither living nor dead. How is this possible? I don't know. It may be related to her persona's abilities, but that's mere speculation. The reason I wanted to talk to you is... How do you think we should tell Iori? You see, she's probably... Yes, it's me. I see. Yes, I understand. That was the hospital. They say she's just awakened. It's hard to believe, but it seems that Chidori really has come back to life. Did I hear that right? Iori? Chidori is... Huh? Uh, is this a joke? Uh, some kind of trick? No, it's not a joke or a trick. She's currently recovering in the same hospital as before. But... Iori... She probably... Chidori... Chidori's... Alive? <laughs> I guess it's a moot point now, but perhaps it's for the best that he found out this way. I think I'll head to the hospital after this, too. Could I ask you to come along? We all decided to go to Tatsumi Memorial Hospital together. Huh? Junpei? You took off that fast and you still haven't gone inside? Well, I mean, it's kind of... We'll wait outside. It wouldn't be good for all of us to charge in. I agree. Go on, Iori. You go in too. <gasps> Her damaged endocrine system and other internal organs have completely healed. She's still weak, but there's no more danger of her dying in two years. Shidori? Is it really you? I'm not dreaming. Am I? Dreaming? <laughs> it's true. It is you. Shidori! Uh, who are you? No. Huh? What? I thought so. Transmogrification is the proof that one lacks potential. I had a feeling this might be the case. This is Kirijo-san and Iori-kun. They were your friends last year. Friends? <sighs> My name is Jidori Yoshino. I'm sorry. It hasn't quite hit me yet, but... I guess I don't remember anything of the past few years. It's like... I was having a really long dream. Chidori... Yoshino... It seems all of her memories after she awakened to her persona are gone. She remembers everything that happened before then. But as for you all... <sighs> Iori... Nah. I think... 
It's better for her that she doesn't remember all that stuff about the fighting and the suppressants. When you're having a nightmare, it's better to be able to wake up. I didn't say it was a nightmare. Don't put words in my mouth. It was a dream of meeting a kind, warm person at the end of a long tunnel. I can't remember it clearly, but I wanted to make him happy. And I... I think... There were flowers. A room filled with them. Ugh. Chidori! Take it easy. Don't force yourself to remember. Flowers in a room. If she can remember that part clearly, then maybe... <sighs> Do you remember how she'd occasionally use her power to make flowers bloom again? She'd always do it for the flowers in her room on the days when Iori-kun would visit. And she would always spend more time on the flowers she received from you, Iori-kun. She never even looked at me when I brought them in, though. <laughs> now I see. Any flower she touched would be mysteriously preserved. I ended up keeping them all for my research. But after the autopsy, I put them all on her chest as a tribute. Now that I think about it, that must have been the night she began to transmogrify. The power to share one's life with others. Could she have reclaimed the life energy she'd given to those flowers? Well, there's no real proof, but compared to her previous state, she's changed. The loss of her power is part of it, but furthermore... Excuse me? Are you talking about me? We were talking about how you want to live now. Hmm? What do you mean by that? Of course I want to live. I have to find the person in my dream someday. I don't have time to lie in bed forever. Supposing you do find him, what will you do after that? Well... <sighs> that's none of your business. <laughs> Chidori. The strength of two hearts connected brought about a miracle. Or, rather, a victory. No. <laughs> Chidori. Hey, hey. W why are you crying? I... I can't help it. I... I've... <laughs> I've never been so happy in my entire life. <laughs> <laughs> Have some self-control now. Let's go. Well, that was good news. Oh, welcome back. Oh, hello. All right, we have and right over here. Oh. Let's get some coffee. Past the time drinking coffee together. Sometimes adding milk and sugar is same thing as before, but we get SP. If you feel like meeting up for coffee again, just let me know. I will. Our career consultation is next week, right? Are you planning to go to university? Yep, yep. Yep, I'm going to study abroad. Huh? Abroad? This is the first I've heard about that. I I'm your boyfriend, you have to tell me stuff like this. Next week, huh? 
So two days before next. Yep. It's been getting restless out there, huh? Have you all seen those flyers at the station? None of that stuff has any substance, though. You can tell there's certainly... There's no certainty in what they say. That's right. It's a matter of probability. Hey, don't give me those looks. The end of the world. Let's discuss the odd. Nah, that's not. The odds are 50% anyways. Either the world ends or it doesn't. Not really. Alright, let's go to the fry. There's been a few things that I want to get some stock up. All of them passives. First is... Fifth amp. I want more of these. And then... I guess... Hazushi. Oh yeah, we still need to do this one. Come on, let's go. You best pick up the pace. Hey, you're heading to practice, right? I'm feeling pretty good about myself today. Let's do it. Yeah. Awesome. I can't get psyched up without you there, you feel me? I've been slowing down lately, so I gotta go twice as hard now. Miyamoto. What is it? And what's with this scary look? What do you think you're doing? Just practicing? Well, that's enough practice for you. Get your butt to the nurse's office. The rest of you, get back to it. The nurse's office? Miyamoto, did something happen? <sighs> Knew it. He's such a bad liar. You can totally tell he's going easy on one knee. I know you have something to do with this. Sorry, but you're coming too. Okay. I just had a call with your mom about your knee. You're throwing caution to the wind, young man. That blabbermouth. I want you to stop before things get any worse. You got that? Please don't do this to me. I need to practice. I heard, Cos. Yuko! And you too? Take some time off, Cos. Practice can wait till you're all better. I can't! I don't have time! Huh? What's the rush? Why do you do these things to yourself? You've been hanging around with Miyamoto lately, right? You must know what's going on. Dot, dot, dot. Wait. He has nothing to do with this. I don't want you to get dragged into this. So I'll come clean. He's trying to protect me. I was trying to protect him. So, the truth is... And that's the gist of it. So I need to practice. I have to win. Or else... I know how you feel, Miyamoto, but... It all depends on me if my nephew ever walks again. So that's what's going on. I don't mind if he competes in the regionals. It's just the individual competition, so we don't have to worry about him bringing us down. Hey, what happened to practice? We were worried about Miyamoto. Guys. I'll let you keep training for now. We'll see how things go. But if I tell you to stop, I'm sorry. You are gonna have to listen, and I want you to go home today. Your mother will be upset with me if I let you stay. 
Sorry, Coach. Everyone, I... I think we're done here. The rest of you, back to training. I finished training with everyone and went back to the dorm. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Thank you. Now, ooh, we have some gardening. Um... Yes, you can. What are you doing? Oh. You want to go check on the rooftop planners together? Yeah. <laughs> I can spare some time today, so if there's anything I can help with, let me know. Let's do it. Uh -huh. Okay, let's head to the rooftop then. I bet these taste really good when they're freshly harvested. I think that about does it. Shall we head back downstairs? That should be enough SP. To last till the end of the month, right? We still have a few items we haven't used. Now then, let's get the single target cards that I need. I'm hoping to build a persona of each individual attack type, so... I'll need a few of these. Single target books. And then, let's go find Igus. He's in the classroom. Oh. Oh, Ming-san. I would like to walk home with you again today. Would you mind? Oh, I wouldn't. Thank you very much. Can we go to the strip mall? I really enjoy how lively it is there. money or anything, you know? Oh my, is that so? Oh, you poor thing. You've always been such a good boy, Kyoshi. This advance on your allowance will just be between you and me. Come on, quit it! I told you not to call me Kyoshi! But it's such a beautiful name. I picked it out myself, you know. It was the name of a fine doctor from my home village. Yeah, I know, I've heard. Come on, hook me up already! Oh, yes, yes. It's not much. Try not to spend it all in one place. Sweet, thanks. See ya! Be careful, and visit again soon. Something I want to ask that Kiyoshi san. Uh oh. Kiyoshi san, please wait. Hey! Don't call me that! Uh, uh, I guess senpai? Do you know me? Well, yeah! You're famous! Uh, I'm uh, Kiyoshi Sakuma. I'm a first year. Everyone calls me Joe, I guess, Senpai, so you can just... I would like to ask you something, Kiyoshi-san. Do you mind? Uh, uh, sure. Kiyoshi-san, do you feel lonely when you are by yourself? Huh? What? Your grandmother said that she's lonely because she has nobody else. What is this, a lecture? No, I just want to know. Why don't you visit your grandmother more often? If you are her relative, you may have the power to alleviate her loneliness. I mean, I am her grandson, but... Look, I don't need a lecture from you, alright? It's none of your business, okay? Kiyoshi-san, have you ever considered what it means to live? To live? Personally. I think the bonds between people are what's most important. 
That's what your grandmother is slowly losing. <sighs> to live? Are you kidding? No one actually talks like that. What more do you need out of life than to have a blast? To have a blast? I mean, you're happy when you're having fun, right? So hell yeah! We're alive to have a good time! A good time? So, what do you say, Aiga Senpai? If you got time, why don't we... Thank you, Kiyoshi-san. Let's go. Huh? What the hell? What, so you were just trying to play me? Screw you! I can't understand Kiyoshi-san's feelings. And I even made him angry. Did I do something wrong? Uh, he thought I was your boyfriend. Boyfriend. A term that is used when one is in a mutually romantic relationship, correct? Is something wrong with that? If I assume you are my boyfriend... My boyfriend? <sighs> what is this? It feels strange to phrase it like that. <sighs> I... Ever since I decided to live, I've been asking why and how more frequently. The more time I spend with you, the more I discover that I don't understand. But when I ask myself why I'm not alive, I never have an answer. <sighs> Is this what you call frustration? But at the same time, I feel extremely lucky. I would even say I'm more fortunate than others, despite not being human myself. After all, you are very important to me, and I get to be by your side. It's strange how two conflicting feelings can coexist. I guess seems to be deep in thought. And we're closer. Rank 6. In all honesty though, my feelings towards Kyoshi-san are... unusually harsh. Kyoshi-san has warm, soft hands to embrace those precious to him. And yet he... <sighs> what is this ugly feeling? Is it... jealousy? Let's stop this. It isn't right. Yes, I am stopping right here. Shall we go home then? And we're gone. So we have four more uh, social links with I guess, and then two more oh, with Kazushi. Back. Oh hello. And we have eight days left. Seven days after this. It's gonna be tough. Hopefully we can actually hey. do them all. Hey, if you're gonna do some gardening, I'll come too. Okay. These little guys are pretty awesome. Looking at them makes you really think about life. They do make you feel better when you eat them. Maybe I'll take some with me next time. Oh, uh, I was just talking to myself. I'd say that's a mighty fine work. Let's head back downstairs. All right then. Oh, there are Sundays, too, that I can't do anything. That's kind of annoying. But I'll call it a day here. Thanks for watching. See you next time.